Hello all. Today, let us learn the VTU Engineering Chemistry Module 2, second subunit, Metal Finishing. Under this headline, we are going to cover the Metal Finishing Introduction, Technological Importance, then the principles governing the electroplating like polarization, decomposition potential, and war voltage. Then we have two examples, three examples, electroplating of chromium, and then electroless plating introduction, electroless plating of nickel and copper, distinction between the electroplating and electroless plating processes. This is what the syllabus of the module two, second subunit metal finishing. It also coming under the course outcomes two, modifications of surface properties of metals, to develop resistance to the corrosion, wear, tear, impact, etc., by electroplating and electroless plating, along with the corrosion. So, this is also coming under course outcomes 2, that is CO2. Coming to the introduction of metal finishing. So, under this headline, we are going to know what do you mean by metal finishing, how to define the term metal finishing, where it is applicable, why it is applicable, and all. We all know that this metal finishing covers a wide range of processes. What processes? Why these processes are useful for us? These processes carried out in order to modify the surface properties of a metal. What do you mean by this modification? This denotes a change. Change in the properties of surface of a metal. Properties of surface of a metal. How to change this? How to modify these properties, surface properties? These processes involve deposition of a layer of another metal or a polymer. Secondly, conversion of a surface layer of atoms into oxide films, which ultimately modify the surface of a metal. That means here, there are two or three possibilities to modify the surface properties of a metal, any metal. The first possibility, the deposition of a layer of another metal this is the first possibility. So what we are going to, we are giving a deposition, means a coating of another metal over the metal. Or a polymer over the metal. We can also, also coat a layer of polymer over the metal. This is the second possibility. And the third possibility of modification, conversion of surface layer of atoms. We all know that there are large number of Lacks, crores of atoms will be there on the surface of a metals. What we are going to do here, the such atoms get converted into oxide films. The oxide films form ultimately modify or changes the surface of a metal. This is what the main theme involved in the metal finishing processes. So in this way, let us try to give the definition of metal finishing. So it can be defined as the process of modifying surface properties of a metals by the deposition of a layer of another metal or a polymer on its surface or by the formation of an oxide film. So we can see this image here, the various type of metallic articles modified their shining nature, these properties, their behavior, so etc. etc. See now? how after the modification of surface, how these metal articles looking like. See these images. Now, secondly, let us go with the technological importance of a metal finishing. You can ask the question, you may ask the question, sir, we are dealing with the engineering courses. We are studying the engineering courses. Why it is so important for us being this uh, engineer? Why we have to learn this metal finishing or metallurgical processes? There is a uh, importance, there is a usefulness even in the technical courses. That is what technological importance of a metal finishing. Let us go with those uh, technological importance. So the main technological importance of a metal finishing includes imparting the metal surface to a higher corrosion resistance. This is very true. If you do this metal finishing technology, if you apply this uh, concept to the metal, definitely the corrosion resistance of such metal may be improved. 
increased increased corrosion resistance after uh, doing this metal finishing technology secondly providing electrical and thermal conducting surfaces not only increases the corrosion resistance of a metal the metal finishing technology but it also provides electrical and thermal conducting surfaces if we have some metals which are having less conducting nature less electrical behavior or behavior for such metals we can improve we can provide more electrical nature more thermally conducting surfaces we can provide this is possible through the technology called metal finishing coming to the third one imparting thermal resistance and hardness not only they provide electrical behavior not only they provide thermal conducting surfaces but also they gives thermal resistance as well as a hardness more rigidness more hardness of a metal we can expect from this technology imparting is giving giving more thermal resistance and more hardness of a metal so not only these uh, applications but also this is applicable in the electronic industries how how the electronic and electrical industries uh, take the application of this in the manufacture of electrical and electronic components such as pcbs capacitors contactors etc we can manufacture with the help of this metal finishing technology and also to increase the decorativeness of a metal surface this fifth application is most used by the jeweler industries most, most of the jeweler industries are use this technology because of to increase the decorativeness of a metal articles especially the silver article platinum article gold article we need to design them we need to give some decorativeness to the metal so for all those uh, applications the technology that is metal finishing help us so we can see this image here how the shining nature the surface properties are improve increasing here see how uh, the modification of the surface properties can be done by painting we can give a layer of some useful paints see this is what the printed circuit board like this we can have laws number of applications technical applications of metal finishing so now we have two important methods of electroplating oh, sorry metal finishing they are electroplating and electrolysis plating now in this i'm going to explain you the electroplating process what i mean by this electroplating electro means electrolysis plating means deposition so deposition of a layer of metal over the another metal by passing the electric current that is the meaning of electroplating but the name itself suggest i need not to give more importance to the uh, explanation of electroplating because you see electro means electrolysis or electric current plating means deposition or a coating so definition it is a process of deposition of a metal by electrolysis over the surface of a substrate the substrate may be another metal or a polymer or a ceramic or composite see now gold plated watch see the frame of this watch gold plated copper plated mug silver plated teapot silver pl uh, silver plated goblet and chrome electro plated tap so before this see this cup here before it will be like uh, it is it was like this after depositing a, a copper so see this how it is looking like copper or some other metals how it is looking like so this is about the electro plating in the next video i'm going to explain you the various the principles which govern the electro plating oh, thank you all